Hey, what's up, YouTube? Anthony Paul, Aikido, Virginia Beach, with the Awama Warriors. We're back again. Those of you that are subscribers, thanks for coming back. Those of you that are new to the channel, much appreciated. And uh, I guess we got Argentina now watching us, so much love to you guys and much respect. So we got a couple um, messages and requests for Kokinages uh, and the effectiveness of a good Atemi. I mean, you have a whole list of Atemis, a whole list of Kokinages you can do. I mean, possibilities are endless. You can do pretty much anything that you can think of and apply Aikido to. So Kokinagis, right? Uh, breath throw or an unnamed technique, right? So if somebody comes up and grabs me and they're strong on the street, right? If I stand here and I just grab him and I try to strong arm him, it's not gonna work, <clears throat> right? And they tell me, I can step on his foot, I can punch him in the face, all right? I can punch him right in the ribs. As soon as I punch him in the ribs, step on his foot, all right, I can do it the same time. I can step on his foot, punch him right in the ribs. He's gonna loosen up, and I can do Ikkyo, right? And then I can bring him up, and I can throw him forward. Right? And do a throw. <clears throat> I don't necessarily have to pin him, so OG. <clears throat> All right, same thing, right? He grabs, well, right? He's strong here, and he caught me off guard. So I gotta do something to catch him off guard, right? Got an attempt right to the face. That braces bounce, grab him, right? Bring him around, get that coke you and throw him. Eek! Right? Keep that coke you throughout the whole technique. From the time he grabs you, <coughs> excuse me, I'm sitting here talking to you guys, <coughs> excuse me, and he comes up and he grabs me. I'm not expecting that. Oh. He's just kind of caught off guard. Now I gotta do something. Eek! Break his balance, get that eek yo. Right, turn my center where I want to throw, step forward, keep that coq. There's that forward energy that whole time. <clears throat> and do a technique. That's just one. Right? He can come up. <clears throat> he can grab my shoulder. Right? Same thing, right? I can come up here for the Temi, I can step over the Temi. Right? Or I mean think real world. Oh gee, I'm sorry. You have an Temi right uh, to the groin. That's gonna make anybody really light on their feet. So you come in. Right, you're like, oh no, oh no, right? Right to the groin. Then you got another one, right? Insult the injury, right to the face. Grab this, right? You can do an Ikkyo. You can come underneath, jack him up. So I pull down here and I lift up here and I can throw him any direction. Right? <clears throat> Take care of your partner. So again, grab shoulder, another Kokinagi, similar to the Ikkyo, right? He's running his mouth, come over right in the groin. They're down there, come off the line, and send me to the face. Grab this, bring us over, get control, right? Pull down, lift up, turn where you want to throw, and slide forward with that, keeping that forward energy <clears throat> the entire time. See, he comes up, right? And he grabs. You know, the front of my gi, right? Two hands on my gi. We looked at different techniques from here, right? The importance of an atemi. If I can't get this hand here or this hand here, I can step on his foot, stomp on that foot. That's gonna loosen his grip up. Grab on top of the elbows, I'm gonna turn, right? And throw this way. Right, following through that whole time. <clears throat> if I don't have Kokyu, I'm gonna have a crappy technique. So without Kokyu, Right? Or in the Atemi, I'm sitting here fighting and fighting and fighting. I'm gonna get overpowered. Right? I got an Atemi. I'm gonna step right on his foot. Right? When you do this with your partners, don't break their toes. Right? Step right on that foot. That loosens them up. Grabbing. Right? All this way I have Koki the whole time as I'm turning and throwing. But then if I get lazy and I just let go and I try to push, I lost everything all over again. <clears throat> he grabs. Right? Oh. He gave me his foot. 
step on that foot, grab on top of the elbows where the shirt would be, grab the sides of the arms if you can, all right? Turning your hips, turn, 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 all right? This hand goes low, this hand comes high, step forward and throw him. Hey! Right? <clears throat> Get into the attacker. It's really important. You gotta have good technique, you gotta have a good attemi. Or if you have a lazy attemi, you're gonna have lazy technique. If you don't have coke you, you're not gonna have very good technique at all and it's gonna look like crap, all right? That's the mentality some people have. Come in, he grabs, oh. I do an attemi, hey. All right, step on his foot, oh. I try to throw him, it doesn't work, right? Why? You don't have a good attempt. You don't have coke you. That's why. He grabs, right? He grabs me, fight. Step right on that foot. Grab, and I can throw him. Easy as that, right? See, he grabs two hands, right? So he likes to go here. Right. <clears throat> grabs some rotator. Oh. All right, what we have really here is rotator and coke you ho, right? We see that a lot. Koki Nagi. But he grabs here, right? I gotta get off this line here, right? But can I reach him here? Yeah. His hands are tied up. I come in with an atemi, right to the jaw, right to the side of the face, right here, right? Get a good atemi there, bring this towards him. Right? I have him here, I can come underneath, get Sankyo. Right? I don't have to do a pin, but I got control of him here. I can bring this out and forward as I keep that Sankyo. Hey! Project that forward. All right, just another variation of a Sankyo Kokinage. Grab some rote. All right. So remember, you're not always going to be ready for somebody to grab you. You, you got to be able to think. Right? You got to you step here. Right? You can turn right here. Right? Move, close that gap. Give an attempt. You're right to the jaw. Right? Or the nose. Come right underneath. Come underneath the chin. Bring this out here. Get control of that wrist. Step around, right into a Sankyo. Right, you can do an Ikkyo first, you can go right into that Sankyo, bring it up, project forward. Hey! Well, Sankyo, when you're doing with your partner, they start tapping or start moving, back off a little bit. The jack hole on the street, make them remember it wasn't a good idea to grab you. All right, or he comes up and he grabs cross hand. Right, or call it gakute dori, right? Same thing here. If I'm not expecting it, you know, what am I gonna do, right? Well, I can come in, I can step on his foot here. He can't stop my body from coming this way. I can step right on that foot, bring it up towards him, grab, and I can take it straight back and throw. Right? <clears throat> Comes up again, grabs cross hand or gakute. He grabs me here, right? He's stopping this from moving. He's not stopping from the lower part of my body. Come over here, step right on that foot, grab, cut this right towards him. And I can get control of the shoulder or he stays holding on. And I can just throw straight down. Hey! Oh. <clears throat> a lot you can do from there. Getting cross hands. Oh. Right, another attempt. Right, you can step on that with that front foot. Step on there, come through. He's that sankyo. He's gonna be worried about that foot. Bring it right in or keep it out. Project forward, you can do a sankyo nagi again. Right, you can do that. We come underneath, get a Yubi door from here, and cut it down. Almost like an Ikkyo. <clears throat> Comes in, grass cross in. Oh. Instead of stepping with that back foot, I get right in there with that front foot. Come through, Sankyo. Right? Transition that to a Yubi Dory underneath. Ooh. Right? Come around, grab here. He's worried about his wrist. Step forward and throw. Right? Cutting that down. One more. Hey. Grabs, right? Step on that foot. He's worried here. Right? He might try to attempt me. He try to punch me. If I step on that foot, he's gonna worry about that foot, right? So be the first step right on that foot. Get that stonky up. Right? If we're drawing back for a punch, don't move in, of course. Get that Yubi Dory. He's worried about the fingers. Right? Transition that. Grab and you can throw right there. Right? right? Whip them straight down with that one. Just a bunch of different ones. The list goes on and on and on, right? So, see, he grabs cross hand. Oh. And see, there's the second attempt coming, right? Get out of the way. You can get Ikkyo here, or even an Ikkyo, right? I can get an attempt right here. 
I'm gonna go straight in him because my body is in a temi, right? Or I can bring us back up, right? I have control of him here, right? I got a shot right there to the leg, right? You can step on their foot, break that balance, right? You come in, knee strike, right? Temi to the knee, right on top of the thigh. Come in, draw that in there, get a nice little strike. Drop him straight down. Keep it like I said, the list goes on and on. But without, you know, just grab Tati. Hey. Without this, right, you're not going to be able to get into a technique. I mean, you try to outpower them all day. All right, again, he grabs here, right? You can step on that foot and attempt me, right? He's going to worry about the foot. He's going to worry about his face. Right? He doesn't know. Right? Get that attempt me, step on that foot at the same time. Bring this over, then you get your EQ. Right? Then you can get your UB Dory. You can do whatever at that point. Right? Shmas. Shmas. Just keep that in mind when you guys are training. Uh, without that good attempt, without that intent, without Koku, I mean, what's the point of doing it? If you're not going to put forth the effort, like a lot of people do, right? It's just another day in the office if you guys aren't going to try. That's all we got. Um, so make sure you guys are catching us here every Monday and Friday. Liking, all right, sharing, comment, subscribe. And be sure you guys stick around at the end of some of our videos because we're going to leave you a little Easter egg here and there. Catch you guys later.